In this section you will learn how to set up an ECU calibration project. You will also get introduced to the core concepts of VCDM. This video is intended for calibration engineers. Several projects can be created within the VCDM system. The project manages and organizes the contained calibration variants. Each project can contain any number of calibration variants. The project defines the scope and general condition of the contained calibration variants. What exactly is a calibration project? It must contain at least one ECU software. The software describes calibration parameters whose values are managed in the project. The parameter specification is represented by an A2L ECU description file. The project contains the default calibration values, for example as a hex file. To create a new calibration project, select via the ribbon Project and Datasets New Calibration Project or on the welcome page the entry Create New Project. Add the project name and detailed information such as the project manager or the person responsible for the customer in the comment area. Click Finish to complete the creation. The created project is shown within the Project Explorer. Open the context menu and select Properties. Go to page Use Case Permissions. Select all users who need access to the project and define their respective access rights. Its primary purpose is to control user access and their permissions and define the workflows for import and approval of calibration changes. For this demo, we just use the default settings. Within the dashboard, select the page ECU Software Versions. Click Add to upload a new hex and A2L. A wizard helps to configure the software. For other software sources, such as MATLAB Simulink repositories, refer to the documentation. In this tutorial, we create two variants and add some optional attributes. Attributes can be used to sort or search for datasets. Assign the attributes defined before to their calibration variants. Calibration datasets represent the calibration of one specific calibration variant. A calibration variant can include a software file, HEX or Motorola S. VCDM also works without a software file. A description file, A2L, Excel or Simulink. Parameter files, calibrated values for your parameter. Select New Dataset. A wizard helps to create your first dataset. Select the needed calibration variants. The wizard allows the creation of work packages and parameter permissions. We'll skip it in this demo. If you run the tutorial from the welcome page in VCDM Center, a wizard guides you through all the steps. Real projects in VCDM can contain many more variants of ECU software descriptions. Each calibration dataset can occur in revisions that capture the progress over time. Please refer to the tutorial video Approve and Release. Projects typically contain the successor versions of the ECU software description as well as their respective calibration variant datasets. Please refer to the tutorial video ECU Software Change.